Hi, everyone. I am Kokwei. I am 23 years old. I study manufacturing engineering with management at USM. I am the finalist of Innovate Malaysia 2014 in Intel track. Today, I will presenting my project which is calibrating and adjusting the position of workpiece mounted on Kika robots arm using machine vision. I will start my presentation with introduction. Currently, industrial robot is frequently used in heavy industrial, such as automotive and aerospace industrial. Mostly industrial robots are used to pick and place the workpiece to the process station. Hence, positioning of industrial robot to move a workpiece is important. There are two methods to positioning the workpiece correctly, which is fixing the workpiece using jig and manual calibrating workpiece by operator. These two positioning methods have their weakness. Now, I will point out these problems. The problem of using jigs and fixtures is first, it use up a lot of spaces. From my study in Spirit Aerospace Malaysia in 2012, I found out that the spaces for process station using jigs and fixtures is 50 feet time 9 feet. While the process station without jigs and fixtures is 8 feet time 9 feet. So, if we remove the jigs and fixtures, it save up a lot of spaces. Besides, process using jigs and fixtures is not flexible. Let's said new product is launched. We need to modify the old jig and fixtures, or replace it with the new jigs and fixtures. Besides, it also produce waste because the old jigs and fixtures need disposal. As a result, it increase the operating cost and materials cost. The next positioning method is manual workpiece calibration system. Manual workpiece calibration is a positioning method require an operator to teach the robot's arm to move the workpiece to a reference point. By doing this, the robot controller can calibrate and calculate the position of the workpiece. The problem of using this positioning method is, first, it is not flexible. Because, operator need to manual calibrate the workpiece for every changing of the workpiece, hence, it increase the number of operators. As a result, it increase the operating costs. From the problems, I come out with the new concepts and designs. My new concept and design is using Intel DE2i150 to build an embedded system that can auto-calibrate the workpiece mounted on Kuka Robot using machine vision. Kuka Robot will utilize the position of the workpiece that calibrate using Intel DE2i150 to positioning the workpiece precisely. This new concepts and designs have many benefits. First, it reduced the tooling costs as jigs and fixtures are removed. At the meantime, it saved the environment as we no need dispose the jigs and fixtures. Besides, it also reduced the number of operators, because no operator is required to manual calibrate the workpiece. Now, it's the time for me to demonstrate my new design and concepts. First, robots are moved to unloading station to pick the workpiece. The workpiece used in this demonstration is composite panels. Next, Robots arm pick the composite panels near to the webcam camera to make calibration and adjustment on the composite panels. Webcam camera capture the image and process the image using the embedded system built by Intel DE2i150. This is the first adjustment. Second adjustment. Third adjustment. Fourth adjustment. Fifth adjustment. Next, the robots arm move the composite panel to the punching station to punch the holes. Next, the robots are mine loading the composite panel to the buffer station. The robot will back to the original position and wait for punching the next composite painter. The process is repeated for the next composite painter. As a conclusion, a embedded system using Intel DE2i150 is successful to positioning workpiece precisely by Kika robot, regardless the initial position and orientation. Thank you for watching.